What is good, you sexy bastards? Welcome back. It is SCG, and I have another GTA 5 online video for you. So I am recording this late Sunday night, so I can go ahead and premiere it for you first thing Monday morning, as I'm going to be away for the next two days. Now, this glitch is how to merge any CEO armor, so either the SWAT or the Army, onto any top that you want, okay? So behind you here, we've got this red hero bodysuit, and I've also got the gloves on it. So I used this outfit because I wanted to see exactly what would all carry over. And it is only the torso and the gloves, okay? So the rest of these uh, con um, components that are on here won't transfer over. Now, you do need Save Wizard for this. And you also are going to need a custom save from FN Glitcher, which will be down in the description. He is the founder, and that is his save, okay? So you need to um, load his save into your Save Wizard. Edit it with whichever um, joggers that you want, with the armor that you want. You can put the logos on it. But very importantly, you do not want to touch torso 1 or 2. Alright, and also the hands. So hands, torso 1 and torso 2, you do not want to touch. You want to leave those as is. But you can change the shoes, the joggers, um, the helmet if you wanted to put the green helmet, for example. Um, and that's pretty much it. Okay, so armor joggers, shoes, and headwear. So do not change any of the torso or hand components. That's very, very important, okay? Now, once you have that done, of course, you'll save, you'll load it into your PS4, and you just want to bring the outfit online, okay? So I'm doing that here in the background right now. So if you're not familiar with it, I'm going to go through it here pretty quick, but I will leave a link down below to the actual glitch on how to bring Save Wizard outfits online as well. All right. So I've loaded the save in, I'm in story mode now, this is my custom save, and I just want to go ahead into director mode. Now, I had that save, so I just had that outfit, sorry, in spot 20. So the outfit that I want to put the armor on has to be saved in spot 20 before we do this, okay? So very important, so if you want to have, say, that red hero bodysuit, you could put just the red hero bodysuit on just by itself, and put that in the spot 20, okay, so the very last spot. If you're wanting to use a deadline top, you could do a deadline top, all right? So if you want to do any of the, you know, white deadline top or anything like that, save that in spot 20. So whatever one that you want to actually have the top on the joggers with the armor, that's what you want to have saved in 20. If you have pre-made outfits like I did with the race gloves as well, then you could use those. So you can do any bodysuit with race gloves, and that'll merge to the joggers, shoes, and armor um, from the outfit that we made in Save Wizard, okay? So, once you've done that, you've got everything saved the way you want it, you've loaded it online. Of course, we're doing the director mode glitch in the background here, so you want to kill the bird, bring it online, blah, 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 blah. So we're just going to kind of go through it. So this is very, very easy. Uh, like I said, unfortunately, the only downside is you do need to have Save Wizard and Save Editor for this. Um, download the save from FNG Glitcher. Customize it to however you want. He has it set up with just all green. So it's like green joggers, green armor, all that kind of stuff. Now, you can do this with any armor. You don't have to do the SWAT armor and the army armor. If you want to do it with the colored armor, you could also do this with the colored armor. So just use your like your crew color, crew color white uh, four or five um, from Save Wizard. So when you're going down the list, I would just recommend picking number four or five. So as you can see in the background here, I kind of made a few of the mock-up ones. Then you go through the rest are green. So I'm going to use the first one here. So we got the black joggers, we got the black racing shoes, and we got the black SWAT armor. All right, and then I also put just the police logos on the arms. So you can also do the logos with this as well. Okay. So main important thing, like I said, just do not touch the hands or the torso because they will be invisible and that's what we want, okay? Of course, you need your Christmas mask on and stuff as well, which that will already be on there. Um, so you can just leave that as is. So just change the logos, the joggers, the shoes, um, and the armor. Those are the only things that you want to change. So once you've brought it online, you do not want to save it, okay? So we're bringing the outfit online right now, and we want to do from here is just go ahead and straight into Crooked Cop, okay? We do not want to save it at this point. So once we've brought it online, we just simply want to start up Crooked Cop. So again, we have the suit that we're going to be putting this outfit on, 
in spot 20. Okay, so it kind of gives us that jersey underneath that camo jersey. And it's going to take the bodysuit that we put in slot 20 and replace that. Okay, so it's simply just replacing the torso. So super cool, super easy. Um, and, you know, if you're good at killing the bird, it's super quick as well. So once you've got your save edited, you can go through, make yourself a bunch of outfits. If you want to do all different colored joggers, you could do this and do different colored joggers with your Tron tops, things like that. So this is another method for doing those as well. So once you get somebody into, your, obviously, your Crooked Cop, now what you want to do from here is we're going to go left once to merge it to that outfit, and then right again, and it will merge it together just like that. All right, so that's why you want to have it saved in spot 20. So we're going to go left and then right. So if we go to left, that's going to merge it, and then right, it's going to merge it back to what we want. So as you can see now, I've got that red hero bodysuit underneath. The gloves carried over as well. It stuck with the logos that I had on the Save Wizard outfit, so the police logos. So literally, this will do just the torso, all right? So it's just like a torso one. So just the bodysuit and the gloves is all it'll change. So again, very, very important to make the Save Wizard outfit how you want it. So put your gloves on, or sorry, put your pants on that you want, your shoes that you want, uh, your logos that you want, and then you can go ahead and transfer it over just like that. So it's that bloody simple. I mean, so pretty sweet. Obviously, um, I've got the gun belt on there as well, so that'll carry over too. I just noticed that actually. So gun belt also carries over. So your gun belt, your torso, and your gloves will transfer over. So just like any other crooked cop, you put your earpiece on, and then you quit the job, and then run to your ammunition and save it. That's it, guys. Pretty sweet, eh? So I will leave that, uh, like I said, I'll leave the link down below for FN Glitcher's save. Go ahead and customize it how you want. Just do not, do not, do not touch the torso parts or the hands parts. Just change the rest. Load it into your game. Go ahead and bring it online. Have the outfit that you want it to merge with in spot 20. Do your crooked cop. Merge it to the left. Merge it to the right. Quit the job and you are good to save it. Alright guys, well, like I said, I'll be gone for the next couple days, so we'll see you when I get back on Wednesday. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and drop a like. And until the next one, this is your boy SCG, and I'm out.